The villagers here seem quite happy. Oh, I hope no one finds me frightening. Lumiere and his ideas. I look like a fool with that ribbon in my hair. So, you're not frightened of me? Perhaps you could visit me again, and we could read some of Belle's books together. I enjoy seeing the villagers happy. I should venture from the castle more often. Hello again, monsieur. Are you certain it won't hurt? Excuse me! Chip would like it here. It would be good for him to have other children to play with. Oh, excuse me. Sometimes my stomach has a mind of its own. And others complain that I'm loud. I'm sure Belle was happy to see you. Oh, I wish Mrs. Potts were here. A spot of tea would calm me. Don't be scared. Please, just talk to me. You there, boy. Um, please come see me. Is that magic? Um, I don't think we should just stare at each other. I like children. Oh, I hope they like me. Um, uh, oh, no. You, you talk first, please. Codsworth will chime the hour soon, and then... I'll see Belle at the dinner table. Oh. Some people are frightened of me. I'm glad that you aren't. Hello again, young sir. I wish I could invite Belle's father back to visit. It would make her so happy to see him. I think Belle is the one who could break the spell. If only I knew how she felt. You have made me appreciate the villagers here. You're very nice. I'm beginning to like you very much. Belle should be here by now. Hmm. She promised to read to me. I hope we meet like this more often. I like knowing you're around. Belle says I should learn to be more friendly. I smell something brewing. Mrs. Potts will be pouring tea soon. I hope you enjoy the day. That is loud! If you ever visit my castle, I will ask Lumiere to ready a room just for you. There must be a lot of stories in this place. It would be nice to hear them. I knew you were coming back, lad. I have an enchanted mirror. It showed me. You are a very good dancer. Sir, would you come here, please? I tried to look my best today but it's so difficult with all this fur. I want to thank you for making time to visit with me. It's been nice. If you ever need a friend, I promise to always be there for you. If you were to visit me at my castle, you could meet Mrs. Potts and Cogsworth and, and Lumiere. Can it really be you? Perhaps this means we're friends now. I hope Belle can see that I never meant her or her father any harm. If this were winter, you could make ice. You're not scared of me, mademoiselle? Good. A visitor? No, a friend. We have another chance to talk. That will be... Uh, uh, nice. Of all the books in the library, not a single one can help me understand Belle's heart. That little contraption can do amazing things. That is amazing. It has good magic in it. You want me to smile? It's very kind of you to visit me again. I can't keep smiling. I feel stupid. You found your way back. You must be smart, like Belle. That wand, it's enchanted. The sun shines very nice. Hmm. I suppose Lumiere will want the day off. You danced very well at the celebration. Belle would like being outside today. I hope she'll join me. Hello, bonjour. More magic? 
I must tell Lumiere to prepare a celebration. Belle would like that. Over here. Um, I mean, please. I wonder what's keeping Belle. She promised to finish the story. I want to find out how it ends. This spell cannot last forever. I will be changed back one day. I just have to believe. Oh, the water is pushed out, just like magic. We can talk a little more now. Good. Yes, you. You there. You. Oh, um, sorry. I mean, please come here. The music at the royal celebration was very nice, wasn't it? Huh? Um, I hope you don't mind if I call you my friend. Greetings! Not many people come back. Um, oh, thank you. It's, uh, nice to see you again. Some people are frightened by the way I look. I'm glad you don't seem to mind. I will always remember you as someone with a kind heart. Hmm. Those flowers must be enchanted. Uh, um, madame? <clears throat> Please come here. Why do I get so nervous around Belle? I hope she likes me as much as I like her. Excuse me. May I try? <laughs> Belle was very brave to take her father's place at my castle. Oh, I regret now that I made her so sad. I've not had many friends, you know. You're very special. Did you enjoy your visit to the royal celebration? I could surprise Belle by bringing her a new book for the library. Oh, I like to see her happy. You are very brave for such a young boy. I promise I won't do anything to scare you. Please, talk to me. Mademoiselle, I, I don't mean to scare you. Be careful that no one gets hurt. Hmm. I wonder where I might find another book for Belle. Oh, I like making her happy. That contraption would be better for washing dishes than me. If I come back here tomorrow, I hope we will see each other again. So that's what it does. Oh, oh, I must tell Cogsworth about this. You want me to pose for a magical portrait? This place is very nice, but if Belle were here, it would be beautiful. Mademoiselle! You've returned. Cogsworth, Lumiere, Mrs. Potts, they're all trying to help me win Belle's heart. I really want her to like me. Don't worry. I often have trouble meeting people, too. I don't suppose you've seen Belle in your travels? <clears throat> uh, I'm not very good at making conversations. Mrs. Potts would, would bubble over just to see such a thing. Ah, my friend returns. I'm not used to having such fine company. There are many adventures to have out there, my friend. I hope you will take time to enjoy them all. Don't you see me waving? It must be under some sort of spell. <sighs> you! Over here. Belle would surely like to meet you. I know she'd be fond of you, too. It's very nice to see you. The castle here isn't my castle, and it couldn't feel like home without Belle there. I understand. It's hard to know what to say, isn't it? I hope you know that you will always be welcome at my castle. What a roar! You... You're back. Belle is so beautiful and smart and funny. And she's not afraid of me. Magic isn't always good, you know. Use it wisely. You returned. 
Thank you. Careful with that. I'd like to give it another try. That is, if it's all right with you. Your shirt is different. I mean, um, I like it. It's just not the one you were wearing before. You're wearing white, like a snowflake. It snows at my castle, you know. That is a curious invention, the one on your wrist. You'll have to experiment with it. There's a mouse on your clothing. I hope I don't look foolish. I do not wish to battle with you. What is it? I suppose we can try again. These paws make dancing rather difficult. Please accept my apologies. I'm certain they would like you to be a guest at the royal celebration. I know that Belle will be there. Spots. That cloth must have taken the weaver a very long time to make. I will never forget how you helped me finish the book for Belle. Thank you again. Your ears. Um, I mean, you must hear well. Hmm, interesting. My servants put a bow in my hair once. It looks much better on you. That's a strange chapeau. Are all hats like that here? You and Belle have danced many times. You're very talented. Goodbye, and be careful. You've obtained a fishing rod. That will be quite useful. Kindness and hard work have done well for you. You should be proud. Um, please take care of yourself. You dance well. I... 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 Uh, I couldn't do it. I tried to give the book to Belle, but... But I got too nervous. What if she doesn't like it? Here, you take it. Give it to her for me. Your Majesty is welcome at my castle. You're doing so well. Please continue looking for those pages. I really want to surprise Belle. Thank you. Thank you for fixing the book. Please, go and show it to Belle. She should know how much you've helped. Belle would like to see your skirt. She likes pretty things. Yes. It's me, isn't it? Oh, you don't know what to say or do. It's uh, nice to see you again, my friend. I care for Belle more than anything, but I don't know how to tell her. It's a nice day for a visit. If only I could make Belle fall in love with me. Oh, but who could love a beast? It's nice to be among people again, especially when they don't run away. You're in your night clothes. Oh, you must be very tired. I don't write often. Excellent. Your long sleeves, do they dip into the soup? I know sometimes I have trouble with that. I have read about an instrument that creates portraits using a lens and a box. What you have must be very interesting. Your clothing is very... Mm, colorful. You're wearing yellow. Belle has a yellow gown. It's very pretty. Back so soon? Goodbye. And thank you. Thank you for looking for the crystals. It's been a long time since you visited. I feared I would not see you again. Your hat? It looks backwards. Until we meet again. Here. It was my pleasure. You must have met the Enchanted Wardrobe. She likes to help people wear different things. A royal celebration is happening just over there. Perhaps you'd like to attend. And greetings to you as well. Goodbye. You look like an enchantress. I hope I can trust you. You want me to sign it? We have violets in my greenhouse that are just that color. I see you have a baton for making music. Perhaps you could play a waltz. I'm so very lucky to have found a friend like you. Thank you for everything. 
the Enchantress must have transformed you as well. If an Enchantress has done this to you, I'm sorry. I understand. I see you have a friend. Good. Oh, I don't like goodbyes. I know what happened now. I got upset and accidentally damaged one of Belle's favorite books. Perhaps you could help by fixing it. Oh, I hope she will forgive me. Forgive me if you thought you should change because of my formal attire. <sighs> I've been trying to make a special book for Belle, but a gust of wind blew through and it scattered the pages everywhere. If you see them, could you bring them back to me? You should tell Belle you've gathered up all the books. She'll be very grateful. Thank you very much. The book's pages are all in order now. The wardrobe seems to have plenty of clothing for you to wear. Your boots must be very good for riding and working in the stables. I believe there's much more here for you to explore. You should make yourself at home. A spyglass is a very useful instrument. Guard it carefully. You dress like a jester. Hmm. Make me laugh. Bonjour, young sir. It's nice to meet you. My enchanted mirror showed me that you came here by sailing ship. I hope to see you at the royal celebration. Goodbye. Different trousers. Hmm. You must be changing for dinner. Bonjour, monsieur. It's a pleasure to meet you. The contraption on your wrist. It looks like something Belle's father would invent. I've never seen anything like it. I think we're getting it. Oh, thank you. This is a great help. If you see any more pages, please do bring them back. Belle was very pleased with the flower bouquet I gave her. She said it will bloom all winter long. Thank you for helping me. This is how one poses for a royal portrait. I'm told that musical instrument will make everything louder. I'd be curious to hear it. You've made Belle very happy, and that makes me happy too. Thank you. With so many coins, beware of ill-mannered villagers. They may want them only for themselves. Be careful how you use the magic from that wand. Please take the book to Belle. I... I'm too nervous. A new hat. It's very nice. Oh, thank you. But it's not quite complete, is it? There's something missing. Some sort of finishing touch. Oh, I know what would look nice. A crystal rose for the front cover. I could make one out of red crystals. Could you help me look for some? Your shoes are very nice. I am... Um, I'm afraid my feet don't fit into shoes anymore. I'd really like you to take the book to Belle. I know it's a lot to ask, but... Please? Belle wears a skirt. It's pretty, like yours. You're very good at finding these. Just a few more, and I can finish the rose. I'm curious about the rails in the sky that carry people to and fro. Aren't you? I see you have a water-squirting contraption. It seems that there are many strange things here. You look dressed for riding. Your horse may use my stables if you'd like. A gentleman often poses like this for a portrait. Let's try it. Bonjour, mademoiselle. I hope my looks don't frighten you. Thank you for coming to see me. A sailor, you must tell me of your ocean voyages. I have a dog who likes to chew on shoes. Is that what happened to the tops of yours? You're very kind to think of me. You're so kind. That is a rather large hat, and very green. Cogsworth has been keeping his eye on you. He tells me that you've been here a while, and that you've done very well. 
What kingdom are you from to dress like that? It's highly unusual. The red you wear is rather like hmm, Belle's winter cloak. That beast on your clothing is almost as odd-looking as I am. That's a good start, but I think I'll need a few more. Um, this is, uh, well, nice. Oh, I'm flattered that you've decided to visit me so often. Well, at least we're both in blue. Perhaps someday I could travel to your kingdom, if the spell is ever broken. Visiting royalty. Well, it's a pleasure to see you, your highness. I see you have new shoes. Oh, I miss wearing shoes. It's so hard to cover these long claws. Please keep replacing the pictures in that book. I know it would make Belle happy. Your hat. Has it been enchanted? I like dancing with Belle. And you. Wings. Oh. If you could help me by finding those pages, I'll be able to finish this special book for Belle. May we dance again, now that you've returned. It's good to have a fresh start on any journey. More crystals. Oh, now I can make an entire bouquet of crystal flowers for Belle. Thank you for finding so many. We will be in a portrait together. Here. Pose like this. Wondrous. I've only read of instruments like the one you hold. I believe it's called a camera. You've accomplished a lot since you've come here. Congratulations. Here, do what I do. Please. Hello again. Are you ready to go to the royal celebration? That brown cloth. Reminds me of Belle's beautiful hair. You're alone this time. <gasps> You've done it. Thank you. Oh, please come back later after I've given Belle her gift. I enjoyed our dance the last time you were here. She liked it? Oh, thank goodness. I wanted to give her something from my heart. You remind me of Chip, Mrs. Potts' son. If you haven't danced at the royal celebration, perhaps you should. It's pleasant. I don't dance often. I hope I'm doing all right. Your hat makes you look... taller. Belle doesn't like it when I insult people. The hug you gave me last time was very kind. Thank you. That is an elegant jacket. So many dances. You must love music, I can tell. You've obtained some coins. I hope it was by honest means. You've been away a long time, but I'm glad to see you've returned. Bonjour, madame. Uh, you haven't come to stare at me, have you? Uh, I mean, thank you for not running away. Your hair is... Well, my fur is hard to control, too. Thank you for finding Belle's books. Reading is her favorite thing to do. Thank you again for helping me practice that waltz. I'm looking forward to dancing it with Belle. I've never seen that manner of dress before. I fear I've upset Belle somehow. Please, would you go and see her for me? You're dressed as royalty. Perhaps you are a prince, like I am. I don't see orange very often. It's cheerful. I'm told that in this kingdom, you can use a fishing rod to catch all sorts of things, not just fish. Your spyglass will help you to see what isn't seen, like the enchanted mirror I gave to Belle. Now, let's pose this way. I'm starting to like this. Mm. Ah, the book keeps falling apart. <sighs> Why do I bother? It would take magic to keep this thing together. You have a duck 
stuck to your clothes. Is that intentional? You spoil me with your attention. I'm not sure if I deserve it. Hmm. I don't wear a royal crest on my clothing. It could be considered arrogant. That looks like a fascinating way to take a journey. Traveling above everyone in the sky. We have blankets if your legs are cold. I've seen the strangest hats here. If you have your horse with you, it is welcome at my stables. Thank you. Oh, this is much better. Thank you. I must tell my gardeners about that water sprayer. They would find it very helpful. I was very impressed by the way you danced at the celebration. And I wanted to thank you again for all your help today. If you see any crystals, please bring them back to me. I'd like to use them for the book. Welcome, Your Highness. Goodbye. Do keep an eye out for the missing pages. It would be helpful to me. Do you wear your spectacles for reading? I only know how to waltz. That's a very pretty pink. There are flowers in my gardens of that shade. Goodbye, and if you have time later, I'd appreciate your help. Your trousers, they're so different. You should lock those coins away. That's what I would do. Thank you again for restoring Bell's book. I didn't mean to lose my temper, but I just got so frustrated practicing a new waltz. I don't want to look like a fool in front of Belle. Do you think you could help me learn the steps? It's been so nice getting to spend time with you. Friendship is something I cherish very, very much. Oh, that's very good. Huh? Oh, you've made me feel happy. These will do nicely. If you see any more, I'd appreciate it if you brought them back to me. I will do as you request. Perhaps you could use your magic wand to bind the book together. I hope that emblem you're wearing means you're protecting the villagers. I could tell that Belle liked dancing with you. I hope you enjoyed it as well. The contraption you have will create sounds so loud. Those around you may need to cover their ears. I wonder how you came to look like this. I'm... I'm proud of you. Goodbye. I hope you come across a few more crystals. What manner of sorcery do you use? Good magic, I hope. Yes. It's nice to speak with you. I saw you dancing with Belle. It's so nice to see her happy. Thank you. You've helped me so much already, but might I ask one more favor? Would you accompany me to the royal celebration? I'd be less nervous if you were there. That is just the number of crystals I need for Belle's Rose. Thank you. You have a magic wand? I hope it doesn't bring you trouble. I think I finally got it. Thank you. Now... I won't worry about dancing with Belle tonight. Belle is attending the royal celebration. I'm sure she'd like to see you there. Hmm. Perhaps you are a hunter. Or someone who invents things like Belle's father. Good work. Goodbye. Oh, I hope Belle likes my book. I see you're wearing a royal crest. You've been here quite a long time. You must enjoy helping others. Your stripes, they're rather festive. Oh, you found more crystals. That is wonderful. That green you're wearing, it's rather calming. Have you forgotten something? Now I'm certain we're friends. You look brave. So say something, lad. I didn't think you'd come back. <laughs>